Welcome to the Nicholas 11X12 technology. Today I'd like to compare the new Intel i7 4790K with the older i7 4770K. First, what are the differences in terms of specifications? The 4790K has a base clock of 4 GHz, the 4770K 3.5 GHz, then the turbo clock, the 4790K at 4.4 GHz, the 4770K at 3.9 GHz. Instead of the 84 Watt TDP on the 4770K, the new 4790K has an 88 Watt TDP. And these are the main differences between these two processors. Now let's take a look at the benchmarking results. Alright, obviously the new i7 4790K performs better than the 4770K. You will certainly notice performance improvements in pretty much all aspects, whether it be rendering or gaming. The temperatures really improved on the 4790K, that's because Intel finally uses a proper TIM again to improve the temperatures. Therefore, it's much easier to achieve higher overclocks. The power consumption has increased, but it's nothing extreme really. I find the increase of it very normal compared to the extra performance you get in certain aspects. So to make it short, the new i7 4790K runs cooler than the 4770K, even performs significantly better than the 4770K at stock and it can overclock higher. Now is it worth it for you to upgrade from an i7 4770K to this 4790K? The answer is no, it's not worth it. While the temperatures improved a lot on the 4790K, you still could overclock your 4770K to achieve close results to the 4790K. Yes, it will run hotter then, but you can achieve the performance somehow. If you have much money to spend, then sure, go on, upgrade to the 4790K, but in my opinion, you shouldn't. But of course, if you're building a PC from scratch and still have the choice between the 4770K and the 4790K, then I'd definitely say go for the 4790K. And that pretty much wraps it up. I hope this comparison video could help you with your choice somehow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas11x12techx.com to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.